Amigos, ¿cómo están? Bienvenidos a un nuevo capítulo de Life is Strange. Quedamos justo aquí, en un lugar en el que me da miedo bajar. No sé con qué me voy a encontrar. This bunker is so surreal. Usar. Un pin de tres letras, o sea, un, una contraseña de tres caracteres. First a padlock, then a digicode. Someone really doesn't want visitors. Voy a tener que subir y encontrar y buscar algo. No sé por qué tengo la idea de que se mueve extraño ahora el, el juego, como que tirita un poco. Idea mía. A ver. En algún lugar tienen que haber tres dígitos. Puedo salir. ¿Sí? A ver, empecemos aquí afuera para ver si encontramos algo. O la ardillita. Aquí anda mucho más fluido que adentro. Bueno, esa es la impresión que tengo. These are thick tracks and definitely fresh. Nathan's SUV. No, acá no hay nada con tres letras. No pasar. Ya. Me parece que no hay nada aquí afuera. ¿Dónde está la clave aquí? Even Harry Aaron Prescott was into selfies. This tractor has paid its dues. Que todo esto ya lo he mirado. Entonces tiene que haber algo que. A ver. There's no way this rusty ass button will activate these ropes or pulleys. Tiene que haber algo. No encuentro nada. por revisar la huella aquí pero aquí no hay nada okay there's no reason for anybody to drive out here but there must be en el suelo tiene que haber algo pero no encuentro nada
Y ni siquiera puedo hablar con Chloe tampoco. Now that's a serious door. Where's Gandalf when I need him? A ver aquí y nada más puedo hacer. Ah. This is too heavy to break, so I'll need a code. Necesito el código. First a padlock, then a digicode. Someone really doesn't want. Uno, dos, tres, ¿cierto? Oh no, it didn't work. Ahí no había algo escrito ahí. No, pero como que está muy marcado. A ver, los que están más gastados, ahí está. Pum. Puede ser, a ver, con 2, 4 y 5, ¿verdad? Probemos con 2, 4 y 5. Oops, bad code. 2, 5, 4. Wrong code. Ok, so it's locked. Some numbers look faded, so I just have to get lucky. Y, um... Ya, empezamos con 2 y no, no funcionó en nada. Entonces, 4, 2, 5. Oh, think, think. 4, 5. Ah. 4, 5, 2. Oh, no. It didn't work. You locked it, dumbass. Some numbers look faded, so I just have to get lucky. Eh, 5, 2, 4. Bad code. Cinco, cuatro, dos. Mire, el último. Oh, yes. I thought that only worked in the movies. Y yo buscando afuera del de la Open de la granja, no sé cómo se llama esta cosa. ¿Con qué nos vamos a encontrar aquí? A ver. Stocked and ready for the apocalypse. This must have cost a fortune. Come on. What the hell is this? More survivalist supplies. Water supplies. It's like in David's garage bunker. Nothing about Rachel here. Look at these cans. David must shop at the same store. A ver, ¿qué es esto? Oh. This says it all about Nathan. He needs help. A ver, estimado señor Prescott, como el psiquiatra principal de Nathan durante cinco años pienso que será mejor dejar de atender a su hijo, dado que ignora todas mis sugerencias, mismas que son urgentes por su propio bienestar y el de los demás. Usted conoce bien el alcance de los problemas de Nathan, pero se rehúsa a reconocer el papel que representa en la salud mental de su hijo. Si no tengo su apoyo, no puedo tratar a Nathan. Así que simple. Así de simple, perdón. Temo que cada vez se desconecta más de la realidad, aunque actúe de manera aparentemente normal. Han ignorado mis solicitudes de verlos a usted y a su esposa, lo que me da a entender que ya no están interesados en mis servicios. Sin embargo, me preocupa Nathan y pienso que necesita ayuda urgente. Si quiere hablar acerca de este asunto, siempre estoy disponible. Atentamente, doctor Jacoby. Jacoby. Jesus, I already hate this place. Tuck tape in a bunker is always a bad sign. Tiene que estar entonces Rachel, a lo mejor está aquí, amordazada. Pero hay que buscar más detalles. Y esa pintura, mira, así como alguien que tienen ahí una niña cautiva desnuda, me parece. I guess Nathan needs the most expensive printer in the world. No hace ningún comentario del cuadro. Look at all this weird shit. That son of a bitch. Bunker contra tormentas, cotización total. 1.350 millones. Ah, perdón. 1.350. De dólares. <ríe> Talk 
talk about tortured. Oh yeah, school suspension is a deal breaker in the Prescott family. Querido Nathan, el director Wells me informó que te suspendieron debido a actividades sospechosas del Club Vortex por tu parte. Eso no importa, solo quería decirte qué clase de vergüenza has traído nuevamente sobre esta familia. Te he dado todo lo que has querido, incluyendo la Academia Blackwell, entre otras cosas que no mencionaré, pero nada es suficiente para ti. Todavía eres mi hijo y quiero que cumplamos nuestro destino. Ese día está más cerca de lo que piensas, así que prepárate para tomar esa responsabilidad. Esta es mi última advertencia. Ese Prescott. A ver, Nathan, te dije que nunca me llamaras de tu teléfono, que usaras los desechables que te di. No puedes vociferar mi nombre en un lugar público, es una completa estupidez. No he hecho todo esto. No he hecho todo esto y compartido mi conocimiento contigo para que lo arruines toda causa de tu actitud infantil. Podemos lograr mucho juntos, pero necesito que me permitas guiarte. De lo contrario, deberás arreglártelas tú solo. Mira. Oh my god. No. Kate. Kate amordazada. ¿Qué onda? ¿Y no puedo leer nada más? A ver, aquí hay mucha información. Rachel, Kate, y estaban ahí juntas las dos. Come on, let's see what this shit is all about. We are. Y Victoria. Okay. A binder marked Victoria, but it's empty. Look, the next one says Kate. Oh no, Kate. No. God, I should have killed that bastard back there. Kate wasn't the first. All those binders are filled with other victims. <sighs> Victoria has to be next. Nathan must be planning to dose her tonight at the Vortex Club party. Rachel. This can't be real. These are all, these are all post shots, right? Right? Chloe, look at her face. She's out of it. Maybe, maybe Nathan paid her a shitload of cash to do this. She probably would have. I don't think so. Why is he putting her in the ground like that? Where? The junkyard. Max, we have to find that spot now. Then, then we can see what he did. There's no way she's dead. No way. She posed for those pictures, Max. I know it. Please, let's go. We have to keep looking for information, Chloe. Oh my God. Oh yeah, school suspension is a deal. This picture is framed different. Rachel is awake and fucking furious. Rachel is passed out and she has something in her mouth. What happened to her? This shot is so staged. I, I, I can't believe it's real. I can't. Is it Rachel and the other is Nathan? Me parece. Uy, qué tipo tan, o sea, tan mal de la cabeza. Psicópata. No podemos hacer nada más aquí. Pero hay más cosas que ver acá. No puedo hacer nada más. Kate looks so doped up. She has no idea she's being posed. At least Kate was asleep through all this bullshit. O sea, un búnker hecho especialmente para esconder toda esta maquinada de, de estos enfermos o de este enfermo. Bueno, aquí también está el papá. No sé, el papá sabrá de esto. Pero no para el fin que fue... Uh, aquí está donde les, les tomaba las fotos. These newspapers are all about Rachel and Kate. El faro de Arcadia Bay. Las autoridades confirman la desaparición de Rachel Amber. 
El tótem de Blackwell, el espíritu de las noticias desde 1800. Continúa la búsqueda de populares estudiantes de Blackwell. Por ahí dice estudiante muere en la, en la terraza de... Se suicida desde la terraza de Blackwell. Somebody likes their whiskey. This must be the crap that Nathan gets from Frank. Needles. Gross. So who's using this fancy tripod? I've never seen so much pricey equipment before. Equipo de última generación. ¿Qué más podemos ver aquí? Nada más me parece. No. Bueno, vamos con Chloe. No me queda nada por ver. A ver. Ah, oh, the Apocalypse Entertainment System. I've never seen so much pricey equipment before. Yeah, me parece que ya ahora sí que no queda nada más. Qué linda aventura. Qué desquiciado este Nathan. Pero esto no creo que lo haga solo. Vamos al depósito de chatarra ahora. Esto está delicadísimo. Puede estar detrás de esto, aparte de Nathan. Frank, no creo, pero bueno. Ahora todo puede ser. Ahí está la venada. La fiesta, ese sonido de fiesta. La fiesta del Club Vortex. Ah, 
I hope Nathan enjoys his last party. Chloe, we can go right to the cops. We have proof. Fuck the police. Rachel wanted us to find her. So we could get real justice. And revenge. The Prescotts have had this coming for a hundred years, and nobody is going to get in my way. Bueno, aquí es donde en realidad convendría más ir donde la policía. Es como lo más lógico, pero quizás qué va a pasar ahora. Especially with your help, right? I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. No pinta nada de bien. Espérame, pero Max sabe que lleva una pistola, Chloe. You're right. Look at the outline. I can't tell if they're different. What is that? Can't be too much. Jesus, Chloe, look up at the sky. Beautiful. I don't give a shit. The world is ending. Cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. Hey, the lunas. <laughs> Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you all right after today? I'm glad you stopped me. Nathan is dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. I was held up in my room. Dude. Have you been drinking? Well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. I know this is a bad time, but can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm pain in the booty. Just one picture. Uh action. We've got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra violence. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. Text soon. El ambiente está muy tenso. La verdad no no sé qué esperar, no sé qué podría pasar ahora. Solamente que las cosas empeoren, nada más. Where the hell are you? Ugh, I hate touching all these clothes. It is kind of nasty. Plus some of the Vortex Club always... Hey Max, welcome to the end of the world. Do you want me to check anything in? Uh, no thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. What girl? She had blue hair, dressed like a punk. I've seen her putting up those Rachel Amber posters. I'm stuck here, so I'm sorry I can't help you. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Who hired you? Mr. Jefferson asked me because he knows I don't have a lot of money, even with my job and scholarship. Senor Jefferson. I'm not cool enough for this school. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. I really appreciate that. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you okay? Uh, no, I'm actually not okay. I, I just need to find Nathan. And don't get too close if you see him. Hell no. This is homework, not a party. I'll text you if I spy him. Good luck.
Voy a tener que empezar a investigar dentro de este caos. A ver, ¿por dónde empezamos aquí? Me parece que no puedo hablar con toda la gente. I didn't expect to see you at a Vortex Club party. I didn't expect that either, but I really need to find Nathan. Have you? No, I haven't seen him. And I'm not looking for him, so I most likely won't tonight. I just hate that scrub. And his club. You're not the only one. Maybe this party will be the end of the Vortex Club. Then I don't have to pretend like I care anymore. Have you seen Warren tonight? I will. He left already, but we're going to map out our drive-in date later. Warren wants to go to dinner first, so that'll be fun. Is that cool with you, Max? Yes, it's great. Brooke, I'm happy for you. And Warren. I'd like to see you happy instead of waiting. Thanks, Max. Though I feel selfish talking about a boy considering hate in the Arcadia Bay echo meltdown. You're not selfish, bro. You're just trying to live your life without all this bullshit. Like all of us here. You seem so wise and kind of invincible this week. I think that snow and eclipse gave you superpowers. Check to see if you're hablando mucho, hay que ir al, al grano. I don't think having superpowers would make my life easier. With great power comes great bullshit. I don't know. It would be pretty kick-ass to battle supervillains over Arcadia Bay. Well, the night is still young, but so are we, Max. So let's plan a drone date next week. Okay. Energy drinks. So are our energy drinks. I know somebody has to use. What are you gonna get that? There's Courtney drinking alone, without Taylor or Victoria. I wonder why. I'd pay money to see Warren kicking Nathan's ass. Oh! <laughs> Epic fail! Or when? Pero ahí nomás no. Uy, uh, yo quería ver si se podía. Ah, a ver. Advertir. Alyssa, incoming! My body! Oh. Of course you stepped up to protect me from another humiliating moment. Thank you, Max. ¿Y qué no sirvió esto? I'm surprised to see you here. El Club Vortex, Nathan. Preguntado por el Club Vortex, mejor. Look at this. I'm at my first and only Vortex Club party. I know. This week was so shitty that I just wanted to be around a bunch of people trying to have a good time. Even if I hate most of them. Victoria doesn't seem to hassle you like she does me. Or Kate. She must know I punch her in the face. I probably should just for Vortex Club posterity. Alyssa, I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but surely in the VIP section, like it's a New York club. Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Why, when I have Max Caulfield at my side? Good luck. En la zona VIP. Ella dice VIP only, Vortex Club. I'm so not impressed by this VIP crap. Excuse me, but I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? I don't give a shit about being a member. I just want to talk Victoria to Victoria specifically told me not to let you in. Nice try. Too bad you're not a member. Listen! No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. Courtney. I need to find a way to enter this bullshit club. Courtney, la que estaba acá. Pero 
pero no podía hablar con ella. Hey Courtney, Ahora sí. how are you? Uh, what is Max Caulfield doing at a Vortex Club party? It really must be the end of the world. Get it? But seriously, like, what do you want? I didn't want to be alone tonight after this week, so I thought it'd be nice to hang out in the VIP section. Yes, it is very nice. If you're in the Vortex Club, which you're not and will never be. So, excuse me. Great plan, Max. Time to find another way into the VIP section. Don't stress, Courtney. I'm still getting into the VIP section. Miguel, entonces. Me falta conversar con alguien. I almost didn't see you. Max, you're the only person I don't mind seeing right now. I was looking for Nathan. I've avoided almost everybody here tonight. Uh, why are you looking for Nathan? Mm. No big deal. Really? You look pretty fucking intense. Nathan bothering you? I have dreams that somebody finally gets his ass one day. Sometimes dreams come true. Today I saw Warren give Nathan an epic head cut. Yes, give it up to brother Warren. Now all we have to do is drive all these goddamn Prescott vampires out of town. That'll be hard to do when the Prescotts own the town and the Vortex Club. I call it the Vortex Cult. Look at this crap. Dress code? VIP section? Elitist bullshit. Preach it, Brother Luke. Okay, I have to get going. Oh, thanks for seeing me. No, thank you. But for helping Kate. And for keeping it real. Peace out. Contra el agua. I'm surprised to see anybody here considering that Kate just told her something funny. I know. I only came because Warren was coming and I needed something else to vent about. This party is such a tribute to Kate's spirit. Por qué dijo casi se mata frente a todos y se mató frente a todo? Um. I saw that the video got taken down, so I, I hope nobody posts it anywhere else. That naive. Look how fast people here forgot about Kate. They'll find some new Blackwell drama and forget about her video. So it goes. No doubt. Um, but I actually have to go now. I'll talk to you later, Alyssa. Can you me ayudar a entrar a la zona deep? Mental, you can't come in. Hey, Max, what are you doing in here? If I get sick now, apparently, Blackwell has a severe toilet paper fetish. Oh, maximum overdrive. About time you got here to save this lame rave. Want to get ripped? Uh, you look pretty ripped already, Justin. I'm never and not happy. Toilet. Why did you even come tonight? Where else could I go in Arcadia Bay on a Thursday night? Besides, Dana is here. She's not with me. So yes, this party sucks. Eh, uh, Nathan. Speaking of, have you seen Nathan? Oh, he should be freaking out in the VIP lounge with that whore tex club. Como entro la sala VIP? Fucking hate those snobby douchebags. Especially Nathan. That dude is gonna go on a rampage soon. You might be right, so stay away from him tonight, okay? Spread the word. Max, 
I know I'm twisted, but your face looks so fucking intense. And your voice sounds different. You okay? How about a quick dab? Uh, no, I'm, I'm cool, Justin. And I have to get going. Maybe you should go chill somewhere else. Fucking A, Maximus! You're right. I'm only torturing myself here. Plus, I'm too loaded. It's time to no get my tanto las conversaciones. Vamos al grano. The tide is turning. Baño mixto. I'd like to tear every one of these things down. Chloe must be around. Hello, can you please hurl and Good night, those sweet prince. Yes, you've been vomiting for like an hour. Max is una feminazi. Maybe you're not the only one who has to get sick. Somebody's either having sex or throwing up. Or both. Ugh, Max. Creo que no puedo hacer nada más en este antro. Nueve razones para mm, Rachel. Ay, ay. ¿Y ahora qué hago? What would a shitty party be without glow sticks? Are you mental? You can't come in. Creo que ella es la clave, pero ya, a ver, ya no puedo hablar con ella. No estrés, Courtney. I'm still getting into the VIP section. Tendré que hablar con alguien más. Ay, ya hablé con ella. I didn't expect. No, I have. You're not the only one. Maybe this party will be the end of the vortex. Then I don't have to pretend like I care anymore. Have you seen Warren tonight? I will. He left. Yes, it's great. Thanks, Max. Do not self. You seem so what? Um. Only with your drone. By the way, did you see that crazy double moon out there earlier, Max? If I saw a double moon out there, de verdad, no I would assume it really para was the end of the world. Well, the night is still young. Esto está so todo are repetido. we, Max? Ya, ya I have to talk to someone else to talk. Jocelyn said somebody saw two moons outside. But Jocelyn... I can't put it in the water. De, de, de qué? De hmm, I could push this out of the way and officially crash the VIP section. Apartar esto. La cara de asustada de Max. Oh, oh. Ah. ¿Qué tengo que hacer entonces? ¿No puedo hacer esto? Ah, tengo que ir corriendo. ¿No? Ingresar a la zona VIP. Estoy en la zona VIP. Que hay dos muy románticos. Nathan es el Vortex Club. 
So his ass has to be here tonight. So Juliet hooked up with Zachary again? She better be careful so he doesn't pull any revenge porn or something. The Vortex Club actually hired DJ Doom for the party. DJ Doom? Yes, but can he do? I love that Trevor doesn't care how goofy he dances in the VIP section. I know Victoria is next on Nathan's hit list. I'm glad Dana ended up with Trevor. Yeah. Hey, Max! I can't believe you showed up. Why didn't you tell me? We could have dressed up together. As you can tell by my outfit, I, I was in a hurry. Dana, have you seen Nathan around? Hell no, I've been dancing with Trevor. Come on and dance with us. Look at Trevor trying to bust the moon. You guys look really happy together. I think we are. He's so different than Logan. We actually talked about life, and he knows how to be sick. I hear you, Dana. But I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him, okay? I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for him. He needs help, but not from his family. The Vortex Club is also enabling. I know. Juliet wrote a story describing it like a cult, and I'm starting to think she was right. It's not fun anymore. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. But look at you. Plus, I like hanging with Trevor and his skater friends. No drama. It sounds like a plan, Dana. I'm glad Trevor is with you tonight. Thanks. The boy cannot dance, though. Look at that. Uh, did you hear something? ¿Puedo hablar con ella? Sorry, Max. Vortex Club members only. Sorry. I'm on the guest list. I'm taking you off. Go fuck yourself, in Victoria. I don't have time for this bullshit. Real cute, Max. You still pissed about me taking your picture? Do you even have a clue what's going on at Blackwell? Kate Marsh killed herself in front of you and me, everybody here. That's not my fault, Max. Don't you even try to blame me. I don't blame you, Victoria, but you know Kate had a church group and that she did at party. So why did you send out that video? Oh, God. I swear we weren't even going to do it. Then we had some wine and got stupid. It's more than stupid. It's mean. Hateful. Kate never did anything to you. And that didn't stop you from taking one last video of her on the roof. I deleted that from my phone. Max, I saw Kate Marsh die. I swear it didn't feel real to me. I kept thinking, did I cause this? Did I? I felt like shit ever since. I believe you, Victoria. But I don't understand you. That makes both of us, Max. I always feel like I have to overcome you. For what? I have no clue. I'm only here to become a photographer, not president. Um, ¿Se dieron cuenta cómo cambió la actitud solamente porque no la culpamos? Entonces hay que estar suavecito. Tienes talento. You have talent, Victoria. You don't have to push people out of your way. You don't understand. My parents own a gallery. I know how this art game has to be played. It's brutal. No, it's, it's art. You don't have to play their way. Mr. Jefferson doesn't talk that way. And he's famous. Yeah, Mr. Jefferson probably won't be choosing my phone. I'm not as talented as I thought. Yes, you are. But we shouldn't have to choose between talent and kindness. Hard to believe, but I don't always make the best choices. Do you think it's like fate we're not supposed to be friends? Somos enemigas. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? 
whoever makes that decision. That would be us, Victoria. Well, Max Caulfield, I could always choose to let you in the Vortex Club. I don't think that's gonna happen. But not for the reason to say. Oh, you look so serious. Le voy a advertir. Está como suavecita Victoria ahora, yo creo que es importante advertirle. Victoria, enough of this high school bullshit. We're adults now. So listen to me. Your life isn't serious danger. I know you're close to Nathan, but he is truly unstable and dangerous. He did drug take for the party to take us from like dark. Oh my god. And I'm the drama queen? Touche. But I am not fucking around. Sorry, but no. No way. Nathan is like one of my best friends. Yes, he takes seriously, but that's not his fault. His family treats him like a total freak just because he has little meltdowns. They're not little anymore. They're deadly. I, I don't care if you hate me or not. You have to believe me. I don't believe anything you say. You're full of shit. Oh, hi, I'm Max Caulfield, and I'm so sensitive that butterflies make me cry. Now, will you listen? No, I won't. You're just pissed because you didn't enter a photo in the contest and that Mr. Jefferson is going to pick me. A real artist would have busted ass to win, but you just wanted to take your little retro selfie. That is so fucking lame and lazy, Max. Just go find a community college. Canta el grano. That's your problem, Max. This is a party, and it's the end of the world. So I am going to get so wasted, even you won't bother me anymore. I'll let Nathan know if he finally shows up. Adios. Chloe. Okay, I tried. She's not gonna believe me ever. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him. He's definitely not upstairs or in the locker. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide him. So we made it. Oh, uh, hey, Mr. Jefferson. Are you both okay? You look like you're on a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He, he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost gone. Get the hell out of here, Max. Okay, okay. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you. I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about it. Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. The envelope, please. Ta -ta -ta. And the winner is... Come on! Oh my, what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to the memory of Kate Marsh. 
She was the real everyday hero of Blackwell. Thank you. You suck, Victoria. Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Well, yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Vamos a seguir entonces. Lo voy a dejar hasta aquí el este capítulo. Voy a poner pausa porque ahí se grabó recién. Yo pensé que Victoria no iba a escuchar. Como que estaba bien blandita, estaba entró en la, en la conversación con, con Max, pero al final volvió a su, a su esencia. <ríe> Veamos qué pasará en el siguiente capítulo. Esto está cada vez más tenso. Nos vemos amigos. Cuídense. Chao, chao.